Hi, hello everyone. This is Mr. M from Algebra Lessons. Today's video is about fundamental counting principle. Um, the fundamental counting principle states that if there are m ways, uh, if there are m ways to do uh, one thing and n ways, n ways to do another thing and um, then there are m times n ways to do both of them together. This can be extended more than two events. So this is actually the basic principle. This is very useful principle you can use for the estimation problems. So the principle itself um, states that if there are m, num m ways to do one, item and n ways to do another item then we have m times n ways to do uh, both of them together so let me explain um, this concept uh, with the help of two or three problems that will make things more easier or make more understandable okay so the problem is this um, you are at an ice cream shop that offers three flowers of ice cream, three flowers of ice cream. That is um, chocolate, chocolate, and then vanilla, vanilla, and then strawberry, strawberry. This is an elementary level problem, but just to begin the um, uh, explanation, I'm using this. And you have um, two options um, to choose to get your ice creams. Either you can have a corn either you can have a corn or a cup so the question is this how many different combinations of ice cream flavor and type of container you can choose so by reading this question itself uh, you can have a guess then we can um then we can um, um compare it with the actual answer so um the procedure how um the way you need to approach these kind of problems with fundamental counting principle is this so if you want to find the total combinations using fundamental counting principle the the rule is this total combinations total combinations is total combinations is okay and it's not working um is equal to number of flowers here number of number of um, flowers number of flowers uh, times um, the number of containers number number of oh my gosh number of containers number of containers okay so here the number of uh, flavor is 3 and number of content is 2. So you have 3 times 2, 6 uh, different combinations available for this particular um, counting principle problem. Or I would say um, the um, ice cream problem. So this is a very basic problem. So to start with the the explanation that's the reason why i use uh, that problem okay so the next problem is about um the same kind but little bit a uh, kind of um you know um mild medium spicy problems like that so this is kind of a medium problem um so here uh, this is the thing you have four shirts you have four shirts red blue green and yellow and you have three pairs of pan that is black brown and gray black brown and gray okay so um how many different outfits can you create how many different outfits can you create this is the question so if you have such a question uh you need to 
follow the same principle what we did before you have four shirts so the number of the you can write the answer like this the total outfit the total the total outfit outfit is equal to the total outfit is equal to uh, number of shirts number of shirts times number of pants that is number of shirts is four and number of pants is three so it can be 12 outfits so this is actually the uh, uh, easy way or the use of uh, uh, fundamental counting principles so you can try write the um, the the combinations but make sure you have uh, 12 outfits okay let me move to a different problem so the next problem is it's kind of a spicy problem um, so it is uh, actually about a password problem so the problem is let me let me let me change the problem um, the problem is come on yes we have the password problem here so um question is this you want to create a password um using two letters followed by three digits two letters followed by three digits and how many different passwords you can create um, using uh, this 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 um, password rule so the rule is you can use two letters followed by three digits so um, you know that from a to z from a to z you have um, 26 letters 26 letters correct and the digits the digits from uh, 0 to 9 is 10 digits yeah that that's actually given here so um, 26 letters and 10 digits okay so how can we find the total number of password um, using this uh, rule you can use two letters followed by three digits so uh, uh, let me let me uh, give you a rule um, the total number of passwords the total the total number number of passwords passwords is equal to so what is the condition two letters two letters followed by three digits you know that uh, how many letters are there 26 letters how many digits are from 0 to 9 it is 10 digits so the total number of passwords you can we write as number of letters number of letters it is a total number of letters it is it is 26 right um it is 26 number of letters to the power how many letters you can use here you can use only um Two, right you can use only two letters so number of letters to the power n this is like the common rule general rule number of letters to the power n times um, number of digits to the power number of digits number of digits number of digits to the power I'm sorry for this um, inconvenience because my body is behaving weird so number of digits uh, my gosh this is horrible number of digits um to the power number of digits to the power m okay let me explain what is m and n n n is actually um, the number of letters you can use that is two letters here m is actually the number of digits you can use okay so the total number of passwords so what is the total number of letters it is 26 so that is 26 to the power um, 2 times um, the number of digits you have 10 so 10 to the power how many digits you can use three digits uh, we are not saying specifically saying how which are those digits um, so this is 26 to the power 2 
times 10 to the power 3. So, 26 to the power 2 means 26 times 26. It is um, 676. 676, correct? Yeah, it is 676. And um, 676. 676. Times 10 to the power 3 is 1000. So, the total number is 6, 7, 6, 0, 0, 0. This many digits, sorry, this many passwords you can use, sorry, you can create using uh, this rule. Two letters followed by three digits. So, this is um, what the uh, fundamental counting principle types of problems. So, um, to get more of the same kind of lessons, please try to follow me. Please share and subscribe. Thank you.